Welcome to Industry Gossip. My name is Manish Kata, along with Christopher Norton. Uh, you guys are absolute animals. Uh, what does it tell us about society that our number one ranked video on YouTube is a show about me sitting here just gossiping about stuff? Um, but it is. So let's let's rock and roll. Christopher, what do you have? So Apex went public and brought in a dollar or two. Uh, the steal, underrated or overrated? Underrated. I love it. Listen, I think large custodians are overplaying their hand when it comes to customer service, and we need smaller custodians to come out of the woodwork and and focus on service. So I hope this money goes towards uh, offering a home for smaller advisors. Uh, I love the technology behind Apex, and I think this is underrated news, and I'm all for it. Last show we talked about SMAs, and now YCharts has added SMA data to create models. Underrated or overrated? Hugely underrated. Full disclosure, we use YCharts and we love them, but this is phenomenal. Advisors really need to check out the, the software. The reason why this is awesome is because you historically have always been able to put together stocks and ETFs, um, mutual funds, etc. But a lot of advisors use models, SMA models. You can now take those put them in a model portfolio alongside whatever you own as, as an advisor and and do the research on that. And this tool, believe it or not, has not existed before, uh, at least to my knowledge. So this is hugely underrated. Kudos for YCharts. Uh, we've been on their case for a while and they've been very responsive in releasing this tool. So uh, definitely underrated. Orion got out their checkbook again and bought hidden levers. Underrated or overrated and... Is their arms, with, arms race with risk allies now breaking out into a full-blown war? Yeah, um, I, you know, I think it's too early to tell uh, if, it's, if it's underrated or overrated. Let me tell you why. We use both, full disclosure. Um, and, you know, Orion has a proposal system. A lot of Orion users use risk allies. It's a 1 to 99 risk score. Hidden levers is a completely different concept and scores things on maximum drawdown. So on the surface, I'm happy that they've addressed the fact that they need a, a proposal solution, but I'm just unclear at this point how it's gonna make its way into the Orion technology. And frankly, they probably are unclear as well. I, I think you nailed it on the head. This is, at this point, an arms race. Someone buys financial planning, the other person buys it. And you know, we're going to end up with two solutions, and, and who knows if it's going to work or not. So I, too early to tell, but, you know, we'll see. Well, speaking of risk allies, something we say a lot is integrations don't work. So risk allies went out and launched this build my tech stack in an attempt to solve that. I'm not going to lead the witness here with my own thoughts, but underrated or overrated? Mm, it's slightly overrated um, because kudos to them for trying because this is a huge hole in the industry. There's a ton of integrations and no one knows how they work. The people who make the integrations don't know how they work. And this is a huge hole. However, at the same time, I just don't think it's possible because I think integrations themselves just suck. And so what, this may be a little bit of marketing, which they're great at. Um, I want to dig in and, and try to do this myself, but I, I think this is slightly overrated because it, it may help a few, but it's going to leave many with questions. I agree. I think it's a cool idea. I just don't know that it's actually possible to implement. This next topic is a sentence that I, I can't believe I'm going to say out loud. Walmart has entered the fintech space. Underrated or overrated? Yeah, this is overrated. Like, I, I'm so tired of hearing advisors whine and bitch about Amazon's coming and Walmart's coming. Who cares? You know, Walmart entered the grocery space years ago. I don't go to Walmart to buy my steaks. Like, you're going to you're gonna do what you do right now, right? And here's my point. Anything that serves the underserved community, I'm all for. So kudos to Walmart. I think they're going to give access to financial advice to a lot of underserved clients, and, and I love that. But in terms of advisors who are you know scared or, or maybe scared about Walmart or an Amazon, get over it. It's overrated. Well, that'll do it for us today. Yes, sir. Have a nice one, guys. Be back soon.